talk about propensity score matching and if you don't know about that then you've come to the right place. Propensity score matching is a statistical matching technique which is used to estimate the net effect of an intervention. It has a wide variety of application but is generally um, used to reduce the sampling or the estimation bias. Uh, PSM is especially relevant in an exposed evaluation scenario where uh, one has not yet collected the baseline data. Okay, so um, we know that PSM tries to reduce the sampling bias by giving evaluators comparable groups, a group that received the treatment versus the group that did not. Now, in any evaluation, a simple random selection might would have been the best way to go forward but it would have been independent of beneficiary's characteristics. Which um, characteristics like socioeconomic um, or demographic characteristics or cultural differences and things like that. Um, which actually gives you two different groups which behave differently when they're subjected to intervention. So what PSM does is, is that it matches them on all the observable covariates so that you have similar groups so that when they're subjected to intervention both the results can be comparable. So in conclusion, while PSM might be a good way forward to match and balance on between two sample groups, um, it does not qualify to 